baby, how are you? Hi, man. I'm good, how are you? I'm good, thank you. What's going on? What happened? So, I think I've been on my phone way too much. Um, kind of like my upper back is hurting a little bit. Kind of like the neck, this area over here. Okay. A lot of tension or is it sharp pain? Yeah, How does no, it feel? just like a lot of tension. I've been working a lot um, on my phone a lot, on the computer. So it's just too much stress and too much bad posture. Is it both sides or just one side? Um, it's mostly like in the middle, kind of like the neck. Yeah, maybe I guess both shoulders a little bit. Okay, any lower back problems? No. Um, any tension headaches? Um, I do get them once in a while. I even get migraines sometimes. Okay. Any pain on your neck? Not the neck, but I do tense my jaw a lot. So I get some pain here. Okay. And the pain, is it on both sides or on one side only? I think both sides. Okay. Have you had um, any accidents lately? No. Okay. Um, has this ever happened to you or is it the first time? Um, yeah, it used to happen when, um, yeah, it ha I don't know, when I was younger and I would be like too stressed. Mm -hmm. um, I used to carry a lot of tension, kind of like upper back. So. Okay. And when was the last time you've been to a chiropractor? Oh, God. Maybe like three years ago. Three years ago? Okay, so your spine probably needs a lot of fixing and realignment. I'm going to take a look, make sure that I'm assessing your spine mobility to better understand how to approach and build um, a treatment plan for you. Are you having any balancing problems right now? No. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'll have you stand up and just walk a few steps, see how your gait looks. Okay. Okay, and I'll come back. Can you please lift one foot up, whichever you want? Good. Okay. Come back. Go ahead and lift your other one up. No clicking sounds there. Go ahead and put it back down. Good. And can you please join your heels together? Okay. Touch your knees like this for me, like like this. Okay, good. Okay, come back. Okay, thoracic spine is a little bit um, exaggerated in between the shoulder blades. So I'm seeing a little bit of a hump here. Upper thoracic and lower cervical within normal. I'm gonna go ahead and just press down and feel for any lumps. No signs of scoliosis. Okay, shoulder plates now and shoulders. They seem pretty equal to me. I'm not noticing any abnormalities there. Even though you do feel the tension over here, I think everything is coming back from your lower spine. This is where the problem comes from. 
and you need definitely a shoulder realignment. There is a slight shift of the right hip moving forward. So go ahead and lay down. Let's see how your length looks like. I'm going to take a look at your length. So definitely the right foot seems to be a little bit longer than the left one. Just because of the shift in your hips. So once we do the realignment, it's going to look a little bit better. Okay, relax your knee. and adjust your toes. Go ahead and relax your knees. Good. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at your hips. Okay, yeah, so go ahead and flip on the right hip all the way. Right. Yep, just like that. Now give yourself a hug. Perfect. And just lower this leg down. Okay, I'm gonna do hip. Adjust it, take a deep breath in and breathe out. Okay, perfect. And same thing on the other side. Go ahead and give yourself a hug and scoot yourself towards me. Take a deep breath in and breathe out. Perfect. Put your arms, relax, good. at your neck. So for this, I'm going to have you take the shirt off. I'm just going to go ahead and fill your neck. Okay, we have here the occipital lobes. It feels very tense. Before we do the adjustment, I'm just going to try to smoothen your muscles right here a little bit. Make sure that we can get very deep 
and once we do the adjustment the ligaments that are connecting your skull to your spine are very soft Is it okay if I put the strap down? Mm -hmm. okay. I'm just going to take it one shoulder at a time. I'm going to use my knuckles to get in really deep. If it feels painful, just let me know. But I'm going to definitely start slow and increase pressure as, as your body allows. Does that feel okay? Yes. Okay. I'm going to allow the particles of air to move freely in between each vertebrae. Right here. Here it is. Okay. Here we go. on the other side too now. Yes. Okay, so let's go ahead and see how deep we can go. This is the part that I'm going to focus more on, and also the one that's connecting right here at the base of your skull. It feels like a lot of fibrous tissues here, so we're gonna have to loosen that up.
feels a lot better. More mobile, softer. There we go. All right. Here we go. Relax your neck. Take a deep breath in. Breathe out. Now we're talking. All right, I'm gonna have you sit, okay? I want you to feel your neck and tell me how that feels. Okay. I still feel a lot of fibrous tissue here, and I think once we release some of the toxins, um, we're gonna be able to really get in very deep. So I'm going to have you lay down. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just lower the pants a little bit. Lift this up. Okay. I'm just trying to feel as if there are any pulsations correlating with each side.
Okay, go ahead and take a deep breath in and breathe out. One more time, take a deep breath in and breathe out. Good. to work on your upper back tension. right here I feel it right. I'm going to slowly increase pressure if needed I'm going to use my, my elbow as well and let me know if it feels too much okay Use my elbow. All right, I'm going to start gentle, slow, and just really increase pressure there, okay? Okay, it's right here. Just want to make sure that we get rid of this knot.
I'm going to apply kinesiology tape on both sides of your shoulder blades. Just going to find the point. Alright, that's good. Right over here. You can take a shower with it. You don't have to take it off. Actually, I do recommend that you keep it on for at least seven days. Usually that's how long this one lasts. And it's really going to help you uh, remember how to keep a straight posture, keep your core engaged whenever you're doing anything, any activities, even sitting down. And that's definitely going to help with uh, spine mobility and to keep everything straight. Perfect. Okay, everything looks very good. I'm very happy with the results. Let's go ahead and have you uh, sit up and tell me how, how everything feels. Go ahead, let's not a little bit. How, how does the back feel? Amazing. Perfect. I haven't felt this good in a while. It's gonna take a few days for you to get used to being and feeling lighter. Um, but I do recommend that we do this every two weeks. It's going to help to for your muscles to regain that muscle memory of how to sit up straight, how to, you know, be realigned with all your joints and all your bones. Okay. Yeah. Wonderful. That's great. All right. So take care of you and I'll see you back soon. Thanks.